Y'all almost didn't want to come out here. Happy Wednesday, the 27th, I think. I don't, y'all, I don't know what day it is, but I'm so upset a little bit. I know this is really petty. You know how you wash your truck or your car? I washed it the other day. We had a really nice day. Like, I think Tuesday, was, Monday and Tuesday was beautiful. I mean, it's still not that bad. I'll sit inside for the weather. It's about 55 degrees, but you gotta do what you have to do, but I hope my car still stays clean, you know. But I'm headed, um, gotta make a few um, runs, gotta go get some money, and do a few things, and uh, yeah, I hope you all are having a great, great morning. Happy Wednesday to you all, and um, we'll check in. Cause y'all know how I don't, I don't like driving and, and chatting. I don't have a, ooh, y'all hear all that water? I don't have a mount for that, so yeah. So I'll check in with you guys in a little while, okay? All right, y'all, I come back for a little while, okay? Um, but anyway, I was just driving. How, have y'all put out, y'all was like, I know people put out their fall decor, but have you guys put out your like Halloween stuff? I was thinking I need to ask my daughter or my sons. Like I don't remember doing a whole lot for um, for Halloween, but I'm a sheer. <laughs> I was thinking about that too because I said I am going to ask her. But guys was just driving. At least gas is going down. Um, and here in Ohio, it's like 350. I got some the other day for yesterday. Yesterday I got some gas for. 341 so I don't think that's bad so yeah I always say you win some you lose some so pick your pick your pick your battles pick your can't do nothing about it right but anyway guys I remember we taking the kids to uh to a hayride um a hayride Halloween field place or whatever and this is why you should not do this to your kids because like right now I regret, but every time this year comes around, I regret as a parent doing this to, now my sons wasn't affected, but my daughter was. However, like I said, we took them on this little hayride thing. And um, all I remember is when we pulled up, everybody got, you know, different races and stuff were on this hayride. Everybody get on their parents too. And as we were driving to the actual building, the hayride took you to the actual building. So when we got up, we didn't even get that close to the building. All you seen was a man walking y'all towards us with this jumpsuit, a navy blue jumpsuit on and this Michael Myers mask. My daughter jumped out that hayride y'all so fast and was running for her life. Like really y'all, <laughs> she was running for her life so fast. Her heart was beating and racing so fast. Y'all, I felt so, 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 so bad. So bad as a parent. Like, why did I force my kids or take my kids to this thing that somebody, um, you know, wanted us to do? So, this is a note to me and y'all, to me, to you guys. I don't know what you guys do with your kids. Oh my God, I'm never ever gonna forget that. Cause it's like, as a parent, I felt like I didn't let them or ask them, what did they wanna do? I just like took them. So it was like, her being scared like that, it just really, I don't know. I just felt like a bad parent, y'all. So I'm just saying, I don't know what you guys are doing with your kids this Halloween. I don't celebrate Halloween. I don't know why people just choose to turn it, turn when I put on their blinkers, you don't know where they're going. But yeah, I choose, I don't celebrate it. I don't celebrate that. And if you can, like, there's some stuff behind that too, Halloween or whatever, but I just don't celebrate it. I'm just, I just wanted to share that story with you guys because just driving, and seeing all the scary stuff in the yards and stuff. I was just thinking back when my kids were a little younger and that. Uh -uh. So, all right. All right, y'all. I'm over at baby girl's house. Came to bring her her little gift. You like it? Yes. It's going to match my uh, one in my living room. So I can take the two solid ones and put them in my bedroom and make my room look more a little decorated too. Now her hair is growing. Yeah, look at I got this one on this on this side. It's uh -huh. than any of them. It's real pretty. Thank you. Y'all, you. she's cooking for her dinner. She's gonna she's catering today, so she's got oh, stuff cooking. But I just wanted to show you guys the other one. I'm gonna put this on the table like she asked me. I'll put this on the table. 
That is the other one. This is her sofa. But I'm going to take y'all in her beauty room. I don't have no room like this, y'all. I don't, mm -mm. Too much going on. But this is her beauty room. It's got these little drape things. Purses. Big old mirror. Do y'all remember when I bought her this dresser? She still has it. Purses. Ooh, clothes. And there's me. There's me, guys. In this mirror, outfit of the day. What you got to say? What they got to say. <laughs> what you got to say? Outfit of the day. But anyway, guys, I'm going to end this. Not end it here, but you probably see me in another part of the video. But I just wanted to say welcome back to another video. And I'll see you guys um, in a little while. Hey, y'all. I was telling my daughter, I shared with my daughter how I was telling y'all story time of how I took them to that, um, to that Hey Right Haunted House thing. Tell them what you said. What you remember? Uh, all I remember, it was a pig. It was a pig or something. He had a chainsaw. He was coming towards me, and I started running. And then I remember we went inside that room, and that dude had us sitting on along that couch right there. Oh, yeah. And uh, he kept hitting the back of the wall with that thing. Yeah, that was crazy. Yeah, some, it was just crazy, like, some, some stuff. And then next thing you know, they was like, yeah, we got to go to this room or something over right here. As soon as they said get up, I opened that door, and I ran so fast. Y'all, I tell y'all. I don't think I, I could have beat. Uh, what's the young black girl, Shakari? I think her name is Shakari. Uh, Shakir. Uh, I can't think of her name. The the track star. I could have been like her. She's a track star. <laughs> no, she's a runner. She's a track star. <laughs> getting ready to go to bed. Not go to bed, but I'm getting ready to end this vlog. It is still currently Wednesday, and I have my eye appointment tomorrow, so I'm going to be heading to bed pretty soon after I eat dinner. But guys, look, I wanted to show you that I did get, I did find a picture frame for that. I'm going to do something with this probably before I go to bed, but I got lucky. So when I took those um, two pieces of jewelry to the pawn shop, they did buy them. Yes, they did. Um, I went next door to the um, Habitat for Humanity and I got that uh, white frame with the metal frame. I'm probably gonna keep the metal frame. I'll do something with it, but I got it for 50 cents. So yeah, just wanted to end this vlog guys. And um, do y'all see my nice shams behind me? So beautiful. And guys, I will show you this light fixture tomorrow or another video. This room is so bright. I'm like, oh my God, but yeah. So I'm gonna end this video and um, I will talk to y'all tomorrow. All right, peace. Good morning, subbies. Happy October the 27th. Guys, y'all know today is my day of my eye appointment, so we're getting ready to go, but I wanted to just come in and say good morning. Hope you all are having a very, 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 very great day. Very blessed day. Love yourself so that you'll be to love others, so this world will be a much better place. So guys, outfit of the day. So, so simple. Got on my big hoop earrings that I absolutely like to have. My two pieces. Can y'all see that? <sighs> y'all, what I did was mix. I mixed casual with classy. Okay, you'll get it. So I got on my off the shoulder charcoal gray uh, turtleneck with the jewelry. I have my black cardigan on and I have on some joggers. Let me turn y'all around. Okay, that's better. So this is the fit. Okay, cardigan. Y'all know I got pockets, has pockets here. My, uh, can y'all see me? Have all my uh, joggers that are gray. They have like a little uh, tie here, which I absolutely love. I have on these black, y'all see these? These black, um, beautiful pointy toe boots. And see, these are gray and black, which I love. And they have like the zippers on the side. So basically this is just like casual chic. Okay, then I'm gonna throw on a hat, but yeah, just wanted to check in, say hi. Look, I know y'all see it. I know y'all see it behind there. Oh, I did take my, um, I did take the jewelry to, um, that light is so bright, y'all, so bright. I have to go get four batching buzz. I do have them here, but they're the white ones. I don't really wanna keep the white ones, but I did find, um, let me show you guys. I did find a frame when I took those pictures to the, um, 
not the pictures, when I took those um, jewelry pieces to the pawn shop, found this at Habitat for Humanity, which is next door. So it doesn't have the glass, but it has this insert, which is cool. So I'm going to take all of that and put it in here. And then, um, yeah. So what am I wearing today? What am I wearing today? She's wearing her mixture of her oil here. I'm also wearing this one here, Woody, Woody Hyacinth. Can y'all see that? That one. And um, this is Izzy Miyake, Somali, Bert. I don't know. Y'all remember. Just go back over some videos. I can't remember right now. But anyway, but we're going to go ahead and get ready to head and make some um, make some tea because I have to get ready to go. And I don't want to be late this morning. Um, so I'll check in with you guys in a second. Let's go get this tea made, okay? looking at that picture I said that's a good glow that's a good glow but yeah I'm finally leaving out y'all it's a nice day though today it's like um oh sorry it's um making sure I got on my seatbelt it is forecast bing bing it is 45 degrees right now I did have to put on a hat for that reason because after I leave work and stuff, I, I will like later on go to uh, get me some exercise. So I just wanted to make sure I am prepared for that. And I got a scarf on and I bought my tennis shoes. I had to remember to go back in the house, grab my tennis shoes because I can't walk in those boots. But I got a word for you ladies today, even men, because it's some men that be doing stuff like this. Not as much as women. Ladies, be careful with your tongue. Keep your mouth closed and quit joining in conversations with other ladies girls females or whatever i can't stand that word though when people say females i don't like when men say that but um stop doing that like stop cackling and joining along when people be talking about other people because when you do that you are just as bad as the person that's doing that okay so um it's just not a good idea D don't talk about people guys i mean i know we might share some things and things like that but it's not a good thing to uh, talk about people because you don't even know when somebody tell you something about somebody, you don't even know if it's true or not. And you do pass it along to somebody else. What you're doing is building up a whole lot of negativity and demonic value that's going to back actually going to um, backfire on you. So that's my word today, y'all. Some women keep your mouth shut. Quit cackling, quit gossiping, quit talking about people. And quit sharing stuff that you don't even know if it's if it's true or not. So that is my tea time for today. Because you guys know, got my tea. So yeah, guys, um, just be careful, okay? Be careful with that. I'll see you guys at the eye clinic, okay? We're almost there. You guys, I made it. Isn't it a nice little cute building? Look at that. I love that. Really, really nice. So we're headed back. I'm going to park. And um, we're going to see what's up. Okay. Oh, there's a parking spot right here, which is really cool. How close that is. All right, y'all, let's do what it do. We made it safe, y'all. I'm actually really early today. I'm like 15 minutes early. I like being early than late anywhere, you know? Okay, let's lock her up. And let's head in there, okay? Y'all, it's not actually that bad out here as far as the um the weather. Oh, okay. Ooh. I have to go down some steps, but it's beautiful here. Yeah. I can come back, you said, and, um... Yeah, let me get you scheduled for this February 1st. Okay. 
well, I got my glasses tightened. I couldn't get, we'll talk about it in the car. I was gonna say guys, that was a bummer, but it's not. I can come back actually, um, I can come back. My appointment is scheduled for February 2nd. What it is is that they did tighten, the guy did tighten my glasses for me. They were really like loose falling off he tightened them for me he didn't have to do that because that was like a charge that i wasn't going i wasn't willing to pay but um long story short i had already had i don't know if you guys remember not that long ago for my insurance i only can go like so many times out of a year and my next time i can go is february um because that's just in my um inside my uh the guidelines for my insurance that i have so it still worked out okay i got my glasses tightened and it lets me know everything was cool because this is a new place. So they took everything. They took my insurance and all that good stuff. So yeah, that is that. And guys, um, I'm going to end the vlog here. I will see you guys in the next video. Love you guys. Bye.